Hi folks, you may have seen my video featuring this fan and it's a 48 volt fan with a quite ridiculous top speed of 11,500 RPM. Now you might think, well, that's got to be as crazy as it gets when it comes to fans in this kind of form factor, but you would be wrong. It gets way more crazy than this. Yesterday, I took delivery of this fan and this fan is also a Nidec G series fan and it's also a 48 volt fan but as you will tell when I flip this over it's got a little bit more power so with a rating of almost seven and a half amps this fan is probably going to draw somewhere in the region of 360 watts when it's at full power. Now, I have powered it up, but I haven't been able to run it at full speed yet. And the reason for that is the power connector that it came with is a standard four pin fan connector. And I certainly am not going to be running seven and a half amps through one of those. So what I've done is I've left the TAC and the PWM control wires connected and I have put uh, an EPS power connector onto the supply wires for the fan. Now there's one other thing that I want to say about this, which is the fit and finish, the build quality. It may look like this fan is just your typical kind of matte black plastic, but this is, it's a solid metal fan. It's very, very heavy. And the tolerances in particular at the edge here, where the tips of the aerofoils meet the inside of the frame. I've measured it and it's very close to half a millimeter. So let's have a look at what happens when we power this up and we'll see what the top speed is.